Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Kinks T. Sassy, and I'm back again with another video. As you can tell by the title, this is like a makeup. Get ready with me, I'm gonna wait. Okay, well, this is a makeup get ready with me. I'm gonna do my makeup, I'm gonna show you guys the products I use to do my makeup. And yeah, let's have fun, have fun with me. Um, I did post on my TikTok like a very quick three minute video and it was really fast of all the products I use but here you guys can now actually see in more description and not so fast what I use how I use it and where I use it because I don't feel like I do do it right I just do it what feels right to me sometimes I do my makeup and it's just terrible like I absolutely hate it but I'm not a makeup artist I'm not a makeup creator whatever you want to call them at MUA, sorry, sorry guys, um, I'm at MUA, I don't do my makeup all the time, I'm not even a makeup person, I just do it when like, for fun, or in this case, for content, anyways, comment down below in the videos you guys want me to do, subscribe, turn on post notifications, so you're notified when to sassy posts, and share this video, and let's get into this video. <laughs> start off with putting my hair up so i was like watching this tiktok and like this girl was like oh um this is all for like the people that are going to become content creators in this year and stuff like that and she was like giving like tips and, and tips and stuff and then she was like oh i really thought she was like oh i really thought that when i was speaking you got to speak to the camera and when i was doing content creating i really thought that nobody cared about what i wanted to speak about like that's just me like i will be editing i'll be listening to myself back and i'll be like nobody cares about that why did you even say that why did you even do that but yeah but guys i'm starting off with moisturizer and i'm supposed to start off with the primer i think it was or whichever but the primer i have is not it's not it. it it's really not it i'll try not to look down i'll try look at the camera this time but oh. but i have my little mirror here. so yeah so the primer i have it's not um it doesn't i mean it feels nice on the skin it's just that when i when i've like let it sink and everything like that it doesn't it makes this like weird finish probably because it's not supposed it's not like a matte i don't know if a matte primer is even a thing is matte primer even a thing i don't know guys i would not know but yeah like it's a weird finish it makes my beauty blender feel weird when i touch it and no that's not something oh guys this was like this is just cerave moisturizer i got this for christmas from my bestie amelia love you for this because i definitely needed a moisturizer i ain't trying to run your parade elf but i don't know what it is like this is the primer i don't know if you guys even can see that away yeah but this is the primer and like i would use my beauty blender of course and it just it, it just feels weird probably because i probably should let it sink in a bit more but it was sunk in like I was waiting five minutes like come on so it's the hydrate in face primer base visage hydrate wait is that the same I don't know if that's the same whatever I don't want to do for my foundation I want to do my eyebrows first let's do my foundation ah I really hurt my finger I don't know why it sounded like that. I apologize. Um, so I just got this new Revolution concealer because I don't use actual foundation on as foundation. I use concealer as foundation because it's a lighter cov a lighter coverage. It's light uh, it's lighter makeup than to do foundation, concealer, powder, yeah, all of that. So I just use concealer. I've been using the Pro Concealer High HD High Definition High Definition 
LA Girl in shade Warm Honey. This one, I mean, clearly it's finished and I've been using it to the dear God. So what I did is I went to Boots and I got the Revolution Conceal and Define. Excuse me, Miss Girl. The Conceal and Define one in shade C11.2 and so i don't know if i'm gonna mix them both and put them on my face but what i want to do is i want to see how this one is just on its own instead of me mixing because i've just bought this one and i want to actually see how well it does so yeah how's you guys new year's going not that you guys can reply but you can reply in the comments down below and i can like you know read them how is has a weird smell how is you guys's new year's going like new year's have you guys done any have you guys actually kept up with what you said you're going to keep up with not like saying oh yeah new year new me and you guys don't do it like that's that's, that's me like i'm like oh yeah i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that and i end up not doing it but this year is definitely different because it's all about me working and my content clearly because i've been a bit more consistent now and nothing's holding me back like there's no reason why i shouldn't be sorry i have like these weird red spots on my this looks like a lot but like because the brush takes off the product i have to go in by the way my beauty blender is already wet because i had it's really big it's bigger than like okay maybe that's just me but i'm just gonna blend so if you guys hear banging i apologize um yeah that's all i can say i've pretty said that on many of my you know videos that you're gonna hear banging but next year don't worry you won't hear any banging because damn you won't hear any banging because i'll be living with people that i actually know and at least with them i can say oh can you not do this can you not do that and yeah it just be easier because you're living with people that you know and they're actually your friends um one thing i need to say about uni is actually a facade like it's actually not a real place people that really think that uni is all vibes it's not i don't know i don't know who told you that it's not all vibes it's actually bad vibes uni is always bad vibes i mean although i am as bad vibes let's let's talk about it <laughs> Let's actually talk about it. It's really bad vibes over here. What are you doing? But yeah. Damn. My hand is already tired. You can tell like I'm not this makeup artist. But my hand is already tired. And for what reason? Nobody knows. Yeah, I'm just seeing if it. Yeah, my skin is absolutely terrible. I don't know why there's weird discoloration going on oh that's just a lie but yeah there's like my skin is just doing up madness lately woke up one day and my skin was this side of my face was weird because not but back to uni you uni people that are just bad vibes that just like to bring bad vibes to my doorstep please go away man i don't want no trouble i never asked for any trouble probably use more where did i put it probably use more on down here because it's looking a bit yeah yeah i don't i don't want to look like i have a beard and i do and what about it yeah that's a bit better but yeah I was like at the club, right? Yes, guys, I've been to the club. Like, please, I beg, don't kill me. Don't kill me. I beg you don't. But anyways, back to my story. I was there, right? And there was this like big dude, right? Big dude. And he's white. So me and my friends were vibing. We're just minding our own business as per usual. Because what else would I be doing in the club besides minding my own business? So I'm minding my business. And he's like he's i don't know what he is he's probably drunk at the time so he's bothering my friend gotta make sure he's bothering my friend 
and he's like purposely pushing her and she starts getting annoyed and then she's like pushing him back and she's like but he's ignoring her like he's not turning around like and he's still pushing her so I guess uh, so I get I'm like okay cool I go up to him and I say yo dog you're, you're pushing my friend like do you mind like just moving over for us so like we also have space to like to dance and whatever like do you just mind moving up a bit and then he was like oh yeah sure sorry about that and I was like yeah it's fine it's cool like it's all right you don't have to apologize just do my moving we knew he was doing it on purpose but guess what i don't entertain i don't entertain immature people is what i don't do and i'm just, I'm just i've grown from that so i go to him he stops no sorry he stops doing what he's doing for like probably two minutes and we're dancing and like we're all like changing spaces just because we're moving and on and that so my friend taddy you guys know Taddy. She's now behind him and he's facing the other way. Talk to his friends in whatever he's doing. And now he's still pushing her, but pushing her on purposely, like slightly, not all the way, but slightly. And then my friend Amelia <laughs> nudges him just a bit, not a lot. Like I'm telling you, it was the most, you couldn't even do anything. And this guy is like big, over like probably six foot, whatever. He's big. So he turns around to my friend, to, no, he turns around to Tidy and goes, oh, is there a problem? And I tell him, no, there's no problem. It's all right. It's okay. We apologize. Like, just turn around. And so even though technically it wasn't our fault and I had nothing to apologize, but he was like, he, he was, because mm, I was about to say he was drunk, but there's no excuse for what comes next. Okay. So we're like, oh, yeah, we apologise. And he's like, oh, is that, if there's no problem, that's what I thought. And when he said that's what I thought, he pushes me. And I'm thinking, he pushes me and Taddy goes on like a spiral. <laughs> Taddy goes on a spiral and wants to kill this man. And I'm holding Taddy back and I'm like, and I'm telling this man, I'm asking this man, why did you put your hands on me? I was so nice to you. I didn't put my hands on you. I never pushed you. I said, can you please move over so me and my friends have space? I even apologized for something that I didn't need to apologize for. And you still put your hands on me. And then um, I'm shouting and the bounce comes over and whatever. And the bounce is trying to think you. But the bounce is even useless itself. And his girlfriend, I don't know if it's his, his friend that's a girl, I don't know if it's a girlfriend, whatever. His friend that's a girl comes up to Tani and she goes, oh yeah, he's drunk and stuff like that. Then she comes up to me and she goes, oh yeah, he's normally a nice person, like he's just drunk. And I said, girl, are you serious? Are you serious? Are you really trying to excuse the man put his hands on me and you're excusing his behavior just because he's drunk? Are you serious? Girl, be for real. Are you serious? Be for real in this year in this cost of living be for real she goes oh yeah he's drunk oh he's known i don't care I, I i don't i don't care if if he if he gives to charity I, I i could not care less my guy still pushed me he still put his hands on me after i even apologized for something that i didn't have to apologize for because it wasn't even me so i was thinking bro and the bouncer like is also useless like he's just he's like oh like yeah i've just put him in like the other side of the room like if there's a problem just like call me like yeah just don't escalate the situation i said my guy so you're not gonna take him out of the place you're just gonna say oh yeah if this this happens i said you're a useless bouncer if those black bouncers were here they would have taken him out the bouncer wasn't black of course the bouncer was um white i guess but yeah like i was like bro people just need people don't have to uh, people just don't have no shame in, anymore like no no shame and don't get me started on the guy that was literally pushing everybody this guy is really big bro like he's big this guy's black instead of white he's big like big big like i could tap you and you could fall apart that's how big he is right guys i'm gonna do my brows and i don't know it's brown black it's like a where's it from it's just a brow pencil guys technique technique is what it's called i kind of sharpened it off technique is what it's called because i got it from the hair shop and yeah 
So I'm gonna do my brows and I'm gonna fill them in as much as I can because I mean I've kind of shaved my eyebrows a bit as you guys can see because I haven't even Damn But yeah so this guy Afrobeats comes on or Drake comes on sorry Drake comes on and but before Drake comes on he's been like dancing leaning on people whistling like you know like knocking people over bro i can't concentrate and speak this is hard yeah so like he's he's knocking people over at the same time and i'm like bro can you not see there's people here like you're just knocking us over like we're like bowling balls like we're pins like this is bowling my guy this is not bowling like why are you trying to knock us all over chillax bro i don't know if he was on percocents molly uh heroin crack i don't know what he was on but all i know is he was he was doing too much is what i know he was doing way too much my eyebrow looks so terrible guys but i'll fix it like, he was moving mad just say he was moving mad pushing people over so drake comes on and then so drake comes well drake comes on and he starts getting sturdy i'm like are you serious are you are you serious guys i need to like concentrate for this like i'll say i carry on the story to me anyway give me just a second Damn, they're not sisters at all. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to fix it, guys. Right now, he's doing up. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing up right now. Especially this one. This one looks too thick. He's getting all sturdy and all to Drake. And I'm thinking, by the way, it's not like a... Um, it's not like a, a Drake song that you, you can get sturdy to, by the way. It's like one of those, um, you know, key key... They, I absolutely hate that song because every time I tell people my name, that's what they sing. So he is trying to get studied to like one of those types of songs. And I'm thinking, sir, what are you doing? And Afrobeats comes on, he's still trying to get sturdy. I said, sir, what are you doing with your life? I said, you're getting sturdy to Afrobeats. You're getting sturdy to Azonto, Azonto. Are you crazy? You, you, you don't know no shame. And I'm thinking yo what is with you bro i said you must be on some like drugs because he was moving as if he's never like moved before in his life like this is his first time being able to move or something or being able to dance and i'm thinking my guy be for real be for real with your life like if you actually want your life be for real but right now i'm going in with the la pro girl in shade warm honey i'm using like a little spiel to conceal my eyebrows because I know for a fact if I use that it's gonna it's gonna do up madness. By the way guys I'm no MUA so if you feel as though I'm not doing this right go speak to somebody else go speak to your pastor please speak to him because I don't I don't I never claim them some MUA uni is like just it's been an experience let's say that it's been a very big experience for me i've realized a lot about myself that i didn't think that i knew about myself oh gosh please about myself in uni and good and bad like 
not that bad before everybody's like what what did you do what did you do did you do something bad no i didn't do anything bad <laughs> how independent I mean everybody realizes how independent they are when they go to uni it's not like I wasn't independent before I was really independent before um just because as an African you're taught to like do a lot of things before you even like before you even turn an adult you're, you're taught a lot of things i mean i was i don't know about every african but i know i was taught a lot of things just because that's life i started cooking around let's say i'm gonna say around 11 12 ish that's when i actually started cooking so like you're just you've just be it's not like independency was i'm going in with this guys whatever this brush is it's not like I didn't know how to be independent already. I already knew how to. It was just now that you're actually in a setting where you pay your bills, you make sure your bills are on time. Um, I mean, you don't pay the bills, so I don't fancy them, but you know what I mean. Like, you make sure you've paid your bills on time. It's your choice to pay your bills on time. <laughs> eyebrows at the end because i want to do concealer now because i don't want this to like crease um not this one not that one i haven't used the elf one this is new and i have not used it but i normally just i did my makeup one time and it was like the best i've ever done it and i used the pro concealer la girl in shade it's a yellow corrector guys it's not a shade but yeah, I use this as like yellow corrector to like right light in my under eyes and use the concealer to light my under eyes. Or it's the e.l.f. one. That's this. Uh, I have this one, but I haven't used that one. We're going to try to use the e.l.f. one. And I hope to my Jesus that I'm only using it a little bit because I haven't used it yet. And it's really light and I don't want my under eyes to be too light. <laughs> my powder in the shade banana this is revolution as well revolution sponsor me sponsor me <laughs> bro sorry that 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 harmonizing stuff reminds me of my brother like if you guys don't know my brother he just does stupid stuff like that and man just like sponsor me or he he will harmonize anything at all and it's not even good harmonizing he's just doing it um so now i'm gonna use this little angled triangle you know what it is guys you've seen it on tiktok but i didn't get mine on tiktok i got mine on amazon and i got a pack of i don't know how much the pack was it was like 12 or something now that i've done that i'm gonna like dab it off a bit with i think this is a powder brush this is a powder brush i'm gonna make sure everything comes off just a bit off not a lot okay wait Oh, 
on the camera it's looking amazing but yeah anyways so now we're gonna go in with a bronzer i'm gonna have to use my little i use the same thing for my brush so don't even come for me okay because i don't have an angled brush and i can't be bothered to get one i'm gonna use uh this one this shade this is the nude ego palette in the buff this one my good sis also got me this tidy got me this for christmas and i needed a bronzer because i have the x fact bronzer that i normally use this one max factor max factor but i don't use that one anymore because i got this one because i thought i lost that one just gonna dab it in there a bit oh gosh please don't use too much kiki me for real um I'm gonna try and get it angled like that. my nose contour in because i don't know what's happening there ah, i just put myself in the eye yes yes okay yeah like that well it's better than nothing guys now that we've done our bronzer, we're gonna go on to my blush. Sorry, why am I? My my brain is always doing up. <sighs> my brain is always doing up. Um, what do you call it? Pause, delete, rewind. That's what it's always doing as if like... Okay, I'm going in with the e.l.f. Sorry, guys. I forgot to show you what it is. The e.l.f. Putty Blush. I really do need a different blush because this one's nice, but it's too dark. I mean, it's still a cute blush, but it's a bit too dark for me. And I don't... Not for me, but... Yes, for me. For me. It is too dark for me. Girlies. I don't know if you're supposed to put your blush. I'm going in with the same blush I wear in my bronzer. If you have a problem with it, go take it up with your pasta. Thank you. Amen. Um, I'm going in with the same blush. I'm going in with the same brush I did with my bronzer. So I don't know if you're supposed to put the blush on top of your bronzer. Or I think it would be on top. I don't know why it would be underneath. Do y'all see that? I mean, I don't really see either, but wait. My lips are so dry. In person, I just, I don't know. I'm not feeling it, but guess what? Where is my lid for my powder? I found it. Not that you helped anyways. So now I'm going to get my spool back because I'm going back to my eyebrows. And I'm going to use the little spool at the end and blend them in. Blend them in as hot as I can because right now they do not thickness and I don't, I don't like eyebrows like that. See the difference it makes? Nobody can have chat for me because, yeah, I did that. I did that yeah boy 
so yeah so you've blended it in so it makes it much more of a natural look so girl girlies if you do your eyebrows and you leave them like that don't do that blend them blend them in my nails contour isn't even mad but now we've done that we're gonna go on to our lipstick if i can find my liner do i want to use this one or do i want to use this one's a bit too dark so i want to use this one i'm gonna use my brow pencil as same thing as my liner tip for you guys if you don't want to pay for another liner just use your brow pencil i do have liners but that one's a bit too dark so i'll face this way guys Yeah, my lips are so dry. I need Vaseline. Well, you need some Vaseline. Okay, so, uh, by the way, uh, by the way, nobody taught me how to do makeup. One day, I was with my friends and I said, you know what, I want to do my makeup. So I did a whole full face of makeup. I didn't watch a video on it. I didn't, uh, I didn't do anything. I just did my makeup and it came out, but that's just what happened. I guess I was lucky. Uh, so now I'm going to use the Pout Bomb Plumping Lip Gloss with Vitamin E in Revolution. Again, Revolution. Sponsor me. <laughs> Sponsor me because I am getting you a bag right now. I mean, I'm not really, but I will be um, in the shade Cami. This is, I haven't used this, by the way. This is my first time also using this. I've only just bought it. Look at it, guys. So cute. It's a plump lip gloss. It smells minty. Um, I don't really use plump lip glasses, by the way, guys. So, yeah. We're going to blend that in. Right now it's looking a mess, but don't worry, I'll fix it. It works the same. Ow! Look at my lips. Ah! Don't have chat for me. Don't have any chat for me. Do you hear me? Don't have any chat for me. For me? For more? Be for real. I also use the Revolution Sheer. This one this one's a really good one and i also use that's not revolution so i can't give you guys that we've done my mascara and now we're going to set my face with setting spray matte now i'm going to set my face with setting spray it's like nyx nyx okay. is that how you say it i was going to say nyx nyx <laughs> sweet sweet <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna set this. That's just too big, no. too flat. You know, these are some small things. This is someone's girl. Oh. Damn! Look at my face. Damn. Okay, this would work right on now. That's good. There's no cute way of putting certain spray. I mean, if there is, there it is. Girl, like, you are a MUA. You are an MUA. need to blend this a bit more because it's doing got cardboard box and I don't like that for me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't like that for me. <laughs> it's cute. I normally, sometimes, I put, I use this shade and put it in the corner of my eyes well guess what i don't have the capacity to capacitate to do that this is the finishing look if 
if you guys liked this video comment down below any other videos you guys want to do like comment and subscribe turn on post notifications so you're notified whenever i post a video i hope you guys like this video and to cersei is out bye <laughs>